Alrighty, so we are playing with some more interesting stuff here. This is a barcode scanner. It can do QR codes as well, so it's 1D and 2D. So there's a Mega. There's an I2C 4x20 display. There's a buzzer over there. And then the scanner which communicates serial. Now it's beeping because of inactivity. So that's a reminder to turn it off if this is going to be battery operated. Now I've trained this to only read that code and that code. So it looks for that code which is 10 characters and it looks for a code which is more than 10 characters which can only be that one in the code. <clears throat> so first we're going to scan the top one and then it's found it and now it's prompting you to scan the serial number. It gives two beeps. Now if you scan, you can scan them in any order. See, there we got the serial number. And there we got the product code. Okay, there it got it. Now if you scan it wrong, you get a double chip. So it wants the product code and it wants the serial number. And then what it's going to do is log this. This is for stores to use for goods receiving. So our product comes with this label. They all look like this. And the idea is that I'm going to use the scanner to scan them in. And it is going to log it to a CSV file. And then they can enter it onto our system. Record it. So as always, the codes in the pinned comment. This is very interesting. This, by the way, is from WaveShare, like so. I've configured it with a QR code to be UART. And it's talking to serial port 1, UART 1, on the Mega. So ladies and gentlemen, our time is up. Thanks for being here. Hope you enjoyed it. Have an awesome day further, ladies and gentlemen. And I'll see you next time for more awesome stuff. Alrighty. Bye.